The presence of bubbles and what they mean is one of the most questioned and confusing aspects of chest tube maintenance. With the OASIS system, bubbles are only present when air is being pulled into the OASIS container. So are they good or bad? Should they be present or not? Both questions have intricate answers that are important to understand. First, what is meant by bubbling? Bubbles can appear in the water seal chamber. They may be constant or occasional, and they may be small or aggressively large. There are markings on the chamber to help identify the severity of bubbling. A small air leak will produce bubbles that don't extend far from the right side of the chamber. There is a numeric scale labeled 1 through 5. If the bubbles only reach the 1 marking, that is a small air leak. If the bubbles extend further, the leak is bigger. If they reach all the way to the 5, that's considered a large air leak. When air is sucked from the plural space into the oasis, bubbles will be seen in the water seal chamber. The ultimate goal of using a chest tube is to remove all of the air or unwanted fluid from the plural space. So when the chest tube has done its job and the plural space is free of air, there should be no bubbles. But that process can take time. So when your patient first gets a chest tube, bubbling is not uncommon and may be expected depending on the reason for placing the tube in the first place. If the chest tube was placed to treat a pneumothorax, would you expect to see bubbling? Yes. A pneumothorax means the pleural space has been filled with unwanted air. If the air is going to be removed, it will need to be pulled out with the suction from a chest tube, and it will be pulled into the drainage chamber. So, you can expect bubbling to be present in the chamber as that air enters the oasis. If the chest tube was placed during thoracic surgery, you should expect to see bubbling. During surgery, air enters the pleural space as the surgeons work, and that air is then removed afterwards with the aid of a chest tube. In both of these cases, you will see bubbling at the beginning of this chest tube's use but that bubbling should slow down over time, and eventually, there should be no bubbling present. As bubbling lessens and slows, it is a sign that the patient is healing. When bubbling has stopped, that is a sign that possibly this chest tube is ready to be removed. There are times when the presence of bubbling may warrant a call to the doctor. If your patient has had the chest tube for a while, and bubbling has slowed or stopped over the course of treatment, it should not return if there are no complications. So if you notice an increase in the frequency or degree of bubbling or a return of bubbling that had previously stopped, this could mean that air is somehow leaking into the pleural space. Contact the physician and inform them of these findings, as they may warrant immediate action. What if the chest tube was placed for a hemothorax? Would you expect to see bubbling? A hemothorax occurs when blood is present in the pleural space, so you shouldn't really see much bubbling in the chamber if you're pulling fluid and not air but you may see a little bubbling in the beginning. Sometimes when placing a chest tube, a small amount of air makes its way into the pleural space, and as it is pulled out along with the blood, it will create bubbles. But that should not last long, and if bubbles start to develop later in the course of treatment, that is cause for concern, and the physician should be contacted. So, are bubbles good or bad? Should they be present or not? The short answer is sometimes. Understand the reason your patient had the chest tube placed, and what has been happening up until this point with that chest tube. This information will help you understand whether you can expect bubbles to be present or not at this time. In all cases, though, we want our patient's chest tubes to be free of bubbling before the tube is removed. Air in the chest is not a natural occurrence, and chest tubes are placed to resolve whatever issue caused this anomaly.